Oh my God, no way. <laughs> it feels good to get my passport. I can finally go places instead of just staying in the U.S. I can travel, meet new people, try different foods, and I can do most stuff than what I can do if I didn't have a passport. So we're in the, uh, the post office to uh, take a picture, get the passport. Here, he's speaking like... <laughs> Having my passport means freedom. Freedom, like I can roam. I don't have to be narrowed down to one spot. I don't have to keep going to the same areas of the U.S. I can travel outside the world. I can see the world. I can just be free. So if I ever cut my hair, would I have to change my passport picture? No. Oh. <laughs> so yikes. <laughs> That's in line better. I really want to help people. In a way, I want to help you. I want to share what I've been learning about my mindset and how, like, because up in like Chicago, there's a lot of violence and stuff up in the city. What I've been learning has helped me deal with all that's been going on with the shooting and the killings. And I, I noticed there's a lot of violence going on in different places up in a, around the world. And I want to share with them what I've been learning so they can learn how to deal with the, the bombing, the shooting and stuff like that. I learned how to get through what's been going on up in the city. We can all get through the situations with a positive mindset. Instead of just being scared or living in fear, you can live in a peaceful mindset. Sent them. <laughs> <laughs> Have the 150 text messages? Yeah. <laughs> That's <impressive>. damn. <laughs>